What kind of car you got, honey? What year? Super handling something, all wheel drive. What year is it? 2017. What we're going to do to it? Uh, put some moon blockers on. <laughs> all right. All right, she has a sunroof moonroof. We're going to put a visor in front of it. The visor, a.k.a. moon blockers. That's <laughs> what we're going to put on. All right, here's what I got. Made in German. All right, we got it. I got it from Cross, yeah, Cross, yeah, CrossFit. I got it from WeatherTech. Comes with some instructions. We will do our best to ignore these and uh, see if we can screw it up two or three times before we actually read these. All right, moving right along. Oh, here, I probably should say this. This is the visor. All right, the first step is open that thing up. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to place this evenly around the opening. So I want to place this evenly left to right. We're going to have the front slightly in front of the sunroof. So we'll slide this back, get it about where we want it. So I, what I'm going to do is I'm going to check the distances from on this side compared to the distances on that side and the distance from about one third of the way in then another third of the way in and check that distance and make sure our gaps about the same all right so let me check our gaps the gap from here the edge of the molding to the edge of the opening is a little over one centimeter it's about the same amount on each side to get my gap around the front of the opening, what I did is I went from here over one foot, left, put me a mark on a piece of tape, did that to both sides over there, and then I measured or set my gap about where I thought it needed to be, which was about eight and a half centimeters up to the front of the molding. Did that on both sides, and that set my gap evenly all the way around the opening. All right, next step. Next thing we have to do is prepare our hardware. This has a little slide part that this inserts in. It should look like that when you slide it in there. Center the, center the holes on each other. All right, the screw will go through the little rubber washer and we will screw this down into this this will mount under the visor all right so here what we got to do here's the hole this has to mount under the hole what this will do will clip onto the underside Let's see if i can show you that underside of the sunroof which here is really thick, but out here where the hole is, is a lot thinner, so it'll be up higher, but that's kind of what it's gonna do right there. It's hooked on right there. Did she make it in? Kind of, sort of. All right, there's the, me with the clip in the visor, I don't know if you can see that. But I'm trying to line it up with this hole. All right, so I push down on that. I have that clipped there. And this screw into it. I got it started. That's all I did was just get it started. All right, so we're going to do that to the other side. Okay, I'm right-handed, so to stick my right hand up under it and get that clip in there, I was bumping that visor so what I did was I put my measuring tape in place and I said eight and a half but it's 18 and a half eight and a, 18 and a half centimeters I put it there that way when I bumped it I could tell and I could adjust it to the proper location as I tightened that up or as I got that seated all right so did that got it seated now you can see they're still loose 
All right, so we're going to use our number two Phillips screwdriver. We're going to tighten them down. The instructions have a picture. We should probably show that picture. There's that picture that says do not over tighten, uh, tighten it till it's shown. I guess that basically till it squeezes it. So not a lot of definition there in the picture. All right, so we're going to tighten them. And basically, I want that clip to come up just up against the visor. You can kind of see by the reflection how close we're getting. All right, it's there. Got a little, got a little tight, and I stopped. All right, so there's that. It's actually pulled the visor up against the car. That's good. Let's do the other side. All right, we're on the right side of the vehicle. Doing the same thing we did on the left. We're tightening it up. And we want that clip, the magic clip. Not just any clip, the magic clip. We want it to go right up against the visor without a lot of force. Focus issues. The screw gets a little tight and it's up against it. That feels pretty solid. The visor's pulled up against the metal. What will happen is if this is loose, wind will get under there, lift it up. And then slam it back down. So this will start flapping. This will start flapping if this isn't tight enough. So we're gonna take it for a ride on the way to go see go see a movie. Then we'll uh, we'll let you know. So that's what we're looking for. Make sure that this does not flap. All right. Install on your sunroof moonroof visor on a 2017 MDX. That's the way I did it, guys. Hit like and subscribe. Thank you and happy cruising.